Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the Golden Lit Estates project. Now you guys know that I've participated in the Guardians of the Reservoir as Mr. Moverine. We're still giving out some drip rewards in that project. There's the Hellhounds. We're giving out BNB rewards to all NFT holders of the beautiful Hellhounds. But this project right here is the Golden Lit Estates project. Now this project is primarily helping the Droplet protocol and in specific the Swifty pools that have not launched yet but we are going to be partaking in a majority share in the Swifty pools, hopefully. Now, because this project has been in the works for multiple weeks, it has been in works when it was at two, three, four, five dollars right? So this was before all the drama that happened with Droplet. But hopefully, once we sell out this project, a lot of the BNB sales are going to go straight to buying Lit, and a lot of it is going to bring lit back over pack so guys you don't want to miss the information that i'm going to be presenting to you today very very bullish so we're giving out three different types of rewards drip lit and busd so guys you don't want to miss the opportunity to get yourself a whitelist spot because i have three at the end of today's video so let's get started So guys, I want to start by showing you guys the overview of my drip and droplet networks. But for some reason, my MetaMask is not working. So I think I'm going to have to switch to Rabi. For some reason, it's connected to my Ether uh, Ethereum mainnet. But once I go to Binance Smart Chain, it just keeps connecting and connecting and connecting and nothing happens. So uh, basically, droplet and drip network are not loading. I can't show you my balances. I can't show you how many GDS I have and whatnot. But I believe that we're still under peg. And this is why I'm super excited to share with you guys the gold in lit estates project hopefully with this project we're going to be able to do some good buybacks and bring lit back over peg all right so it's going to be another addition to the mechanics it's completely separate from droplet like we're not we're not partnering with them we're not uh you know uh, joining forces this is basically the baby of Mushad max a couple of weeks ago before the whole drama happened he came to me and he goes you know i'm thinking of doing this kind of project we want to you know help uh, participate in the community effort that he wanted to help you know offer investors and and contribute to the community by offering some drip and and lit tokens right that was before the drama even happened crypto craft put in so much effort in designing these nfts designing these logos like these guys are doing some tremendous work i'm gonna leave their links in the description below they do a bunch of stuff for all of you content creators or anybody who just wants to update and refresh their twitter banners and youtube banners uh, so they do like banners they do pictures they do memes they do white papers they're actually working on the drip marketing dow um i'm planning on starting a garden on the drip marketing dow so that's going to be another video but i'll get to that eventually so guys, I'm going to go over the white paper. If you guys have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. Uh, I'm super excited about this project and, and I'm super excited to see what you guys are going to be getting as the NFTs because these NFTs are very creative. Like these are some nice NFTs you guys are going to see. So let's start by the mission statement. Essentially, it's created primarily to add a solid foundation to the Swifty contract. And as I told you guys, this was when Swifty was announced a few weeks later. Mushad was like, if we add a solid foundation of our project in Swifty, then that's going to be able to generate a lot of these rewards to investors, right? GDS, the USD, and, you know, we're going to be able to do some drip and lit buybacks, right? So this is supposed to be primarily helping the Swifty contract, but there's so many other crazy ideas that we've had that is going to make this project stand out. And I feel like it's one of the only ones that's of this nature in DeFi. If you guys know any other projects that do this kind of stuff, let us know. But you know, uh, I feel like this project is very, very special and very unique. All right. So essentially, Swifty increases liquidity, reduces price volatility, and enhances price stability for the native tokens, GDS and LIT. Our objective is to hold a significant position uh, for the whole lifespan of the project, resulting in substantial rewards to NFT holders and creating real utility for NFTs. Providing educational exposure is a key component. You guys know me. I love to educate you guys. I love to educate the community. A lot of you guys are in my DMs all the time asking me questions about how, uh, you know, navigate the blockchain, how to transfer some tokens from one place to the other, how to invest in certain to tokens, uh, how to, you know, participate in this project versus this project. So, you know, I'm always ready. I never charge for anybody for any consultations. I'm always ready to educate because I believe that everybody is deserving of the right kind of information, no matter what industry. 
before they get started because I don't want to see you guys get wrecked like I was wrecked in the beginning. And I'm, you know, I'm going to say it. I got wrecked in the beginning because I was new and I was just excited and I just jumped, jumped in. I dived in head first. You know what I mean? So education is going to be a big part of this project and we're going to be sharing that with you guys in a bit. Uh, it's not going to be for this phase. It's going to be probably for a future phase, but it's going to be good, guys. It's going to be super bullish. Like we're going to get into that eventually. This is the kind of stuff that you're going to be expecting, guys. You're going to have a butler. You're going to have nice cars. You're going to have jewelry. You know, you're going to have mansion that is super shiny and super lit. You know what I mean? These are some of the NFTs that we have. We, we've we shown a few of them. We haven't shown all of them because we want to keep a bit of surprise there. You guys are seeing there. We have some super cool frames with all of these, you know, tokens. So we have the drip. We have lit. We have uh, the golden drip share. So we want this to really be something that's going to be sustaining the native tokens, lit and GDS. But we also want to give rewards in BUSD if you guys want to join the garden. If you guys want to, you know, buy some pigs. If you want to buy some dogs. If you want to buy some more lit, if you want to buy some more lit BUSD LPs, you can do whatever you want. You could be a weekly winner, right? So we're going to get into the rewards and incentives in just a bit. But look at this private jet, guys. Isn't that something you want to fly in? I want to go into, into a golden and black themed jet like this. Isn't it looking super bullish? So we have office, limousine. This is the pilot. So basically, there's an NFT that's going to be standard and there's a luxury NFT that's associated with it. It's a pair. We have the sailboat and there's probably going to be another one that goes with it like, you know, the captain. But you guys are going to see that eventually when it launches. So whitelists are going to be launching on the 14th. So it's going to be this Friday. And then the NFT project is going to be launching on the 15th. Everybody can be able to can go at that point to the website and just mend their NFTs. It's going to be super, super cool. All right, guys, so the tokenomics. OK, so to provide longevity for the NFT project, our tokenomics have been designed to reinvest weekly earnings to increase our weekly generated rewards. So every time we get earnings every week, we give out the rewards and then we reinvest the rest. And we're going to keep compounding and growing our rewards and compounding and growing our rewards. It's going to be super cool, guys. Like this is the time to build because this is a bear market. We're still haven't found a floor that's going to catapult us to the bull market. The bull run is going to start somewhere around the end of 2024, beginning of 2025, because the Bitcoin halving is in 380 days or 384 days, basically. So once the Bitcoin halving comes, that's when all the altcoins and Bitcoin and Ethereum are going to explode. And this is what we have to look out for, right? So we want to build right now. We're going to be building our drip bags. We're going to be building our pig bags, our dog bags, our... You know, all of our bags, basically, including the lid GDS, BUSD, USDT, you know, and all the other projects that I talk to you guys about all the time on this on this channel. So the BNB collected from the sales, 40% of that is going to be going to droplet pools. So that could be lid BUSD. It could be lid BNB. It could be GDS BUSD. Primarily, what we want to focus on is the Swifty pool. 40% of those funds are going to go to the droplet pools. Then we have 40% going to the boardroom because we want to be getting more and more lit, right? The more lit we get, the more we can pair it with the GDS that's being generated in the droplet pool. So we can keep that system flowing and flowing and flowing. And then 20% of that is going to go to the golden lit estate drip faucet. So to help the drip network, we're going to be starting a faucet and we're going to be locking some drip tokens in there. We're probably going to be starting it off with a couple hundred B, um, couple hundred drips to get that compounding but we're going to be adding 20 percent of those rewards into that faucet and then we're going to use those rewards on a weekly basis that's going to be on every friday we're going to be, we're going to be talking about that as you guys can see there's going to be some BYZ rewards some lit and some drip but we'll go into those details in a bit later on in the video all right so from the droplet pools, we're going to be taking 70% of that that's going to be giving out as GDS rewards to investors. And a part of that is going to be used for the drip, for the Lit Academy giveaways and project upkeep because we want to keep working on this project. It's something that's going to be built on top of Droplet. As I told you guys, we're not affiliated with the, with the Droplet protocol, but we want to help have a big position to sustain the native tokens because we're fans of the project. You know what I mean? So there's going to be a lot of it that's going to be used for the Lit uh, Academy, some giveaways for the community and the project upkeep. 30% of those GDS rewards are going to be staked in the boardroom to generate more and more Lit tokens so that we can pair them with more GDS. Now over here, we have other NFTs. We have the Black Card. We have the Mansion. We have a beautiful overlook, overview. 
eagle view of of this beautiful mansion didn't cryptocraft destroy these nfts they look so good even that question mark looks so good right man look at this gardener this guy looks like so like in his vibe you know what i mean like i don't know man this looks so so good look at these roses they look beautiful i can never get a rose like this now that's some kind of gardener that i want to have you know what i mean all right the rewards so there's going to be weekly rewards in Drip, BUSD, and Lit Tokens, right? So the winner of BUSD will have the rewards sent directly to the wallet address. Lit will have it directly sent to the wallet address. And Drip is going to be airdropped directly to somebody's faucet. So if you are going to be an NFT holder, we suggest you have a faucet running. That way, we airdrop that to you. Otherwise, we can't send it to your wallet because sending it to your wallet, you can just sell it. That's not the point of the project. We want you guys to keep it locked in into the protocol so that we can help the sustainability of the Drip Network project. All right, so guys, there's standard and there's luxury NFT holders, right? So if you're a standard NFT holder, we're going to get into the pricing later on. You can earn some BUSD. As I said, guys, we are going to be investing in the boardroom. So there's going to be a lot of lit being generated. So you can get 30% if you're the winner of the lit that's generated from the boardroom. And there's going to be a uh, winner that's going to be getting one day's worth of the claim from the Golden Lit Estates drip faucet. Right. So there's going to be a one day's worth. If, if there's 1500 drips, you're going to be winning 15 drip. If there's 15,000, you're going to be winning 150, 150 drip. Right. So as the project compounds and grows, the more we have in the faucet, the bigger the rewards are going to be for all the investors. If you're a luxury NFT holder and then you your NFT gets picked, then you can win some BUSD. You can win 40% of the lit, so that's 10% more of the lids that's generated from the boardroom. Or you can get a two days worth of claim from the Golden Lit Estate Strip Foss. All right, guys, so that's going to be super bullish for all luxury NFT holders. I know I'm going to be grabbing myself standard and luxury NFT. So additionally, NFT holders will have access to the Golden Lit Academy, which will provide massive benefits for those that hold NFTs throughout the life of the project. And those that want to participate in the Golden Lit Academy, essentially, that is going to require a minimum number of NFTs. And we're going to get to that in the future once we standardize those rules. So by collecting all 30 NFTs, guys, you're going to be able to force the Golden Lit Estate NFT card. And that card essentially is going to have some massive rewards. I don't even know what those rewards are. You know, I know they're massive, but I don't even know. You know, I've been told a while ago, but I don't know if they've, they've been changed. But I know they're going to be massive because we're not going to have you guys collect all 30 and not give you something very very worth it and worthwhile right so you guys want to grab one of those the nft will have heavy rewards and incentives that will only be revealed when you acquire that rare nft so nobody knows what those rewards are and we suggest that everybody who ends up getting it not share with anybody else now there's going to be a phase two nft card that will introduce during phase phase one which is called the wild card nobody knows what that wild card is until the collection sells out completely then we're going to announce what the wild card is essentially it's going to help you uh and be entered into a draw anyway so we don't suggest you sell it if you want to sell it you can go ahead and sell but you don't know what the surprise card is and what it offers you for the future this wild card will not will not be found in phase two so you can only get this card in phase one so if you get it it's kind of going to be a rare card so I'm, i suggest that you guys keep it you know now this is how to mint the nfts right so there's going to be the standard for 0.1 bnb the luxury for 0.2 BNB, the whitelist card packs, which you guys have been very, uh, very happy to be collecting on Telegram, Twitter, late night lit talks. We've been giving those whitelist spots left, right, and center. And I'm going to tell you how to win three in my video today. But basically, it's a 1 BNB card pack. So you just like you go to the, you know, Depener and then get a card pack for Pokemon. And, you know, there's a bunch of cards inside. This is the same kind of concept. You're going to be getting eight cards in the whitelist card pack, right? So if you were to purchase the eight cards separately, because we are going to make it easier for you by giving you four of each and we're going to pair them together. If you are going to be buying them separately, then it's going to cost you 1.2 BNB. Whereas if you get the whitelist, you get it for 1 BNB. So you're going to get a discount off the bat. Uh, and the website is going to be goldenlitestates.xyz. It's not live right now, but we're almost finished by setting up everything. The mint button is there. The cards are all, uh, you know, locked and loaded. We just have to finalize some aesthetics and then it's going to be ready to go. There's going to be a total of 1,100 NFT cards for phase one. 
Now, the G Lit Payday. So every Friday on the Late Night Lit Talks, we are going to be giving out all of those rewards. So the Lit, Drip, BYZ rewards are all going to be giving out during the Late Night Lit Talks every Friday. So you guys, if you want to be uh, there when we pick out the winners, maybe that's going to be you. You are going to be able to get that all uh, live on the Late Night Lit Talks. And it's going to be basically something religious that we're going to be doing every Friday right so three random winners will be selected each week to win drip b was the lit reward the more nfts you own the higher the probability of winning weekly rewards so so let's say i have one card and you have 15 cards you have 14 more chances to win in the weekly draw than i have because i have only one card right now the lit academy basically to be lit means you are enlightened free from ignorance and misinformation and the reason why we created the lit academy is because you guys know mushad he's the lit teacher I like educating. You guys know all the guys that are involved in this project love teaching. And this is what we're trying to get added to this project. We want to set up kind of a university of everything that you guys want to get out of this cryptocurrency virtual world, right? So you're going to get cryptocurrency classes, real estate classes, marketing, coaching, health and wellness, and many more. So you guys can kind of guess who we're going to have teach for us. This is going to be one of the most educated community in DeFi, guys. You guys want to be part of this community. It's going to be fun. I I want to participate in these Lit Academy classes because the, the more I learn, the more I can teach you guys, and the more we all prosper in this community because you guys know we're going to be building for the next bull run, and we want to know how to potentially diversify our profits from that bull run into real estate and to other projects you know we want to learn how to maneuver ourselves in this uh in this crypto world you know so we're ha we're gonna have seminars game nights movie nights we're gonna basically we basically want to have a community where you know we're tight-knit we want to be a good family together we want to be a good community we want to be close to each other like you know there's way too much divide going on in DeFi. there's way too much you know separation just like that drama that happened to drip community and drop the community like it's so undeserving and so unwarranted and you know it's not something that i that i live by i don't like that i like everything to be fair everything to be open everything to be clear and you know just just lit just have a good vibe to each other so this is what we try to have we want to have a community where the people that exclusively have these nfts are going to be able to benefit from knowledge that you're going to have to pay thousands for in the real world where here you're going to be able to get it for a couple of hundred bucks you know so basically the team we have mushad max the founder of this project he came to us when droplet was doing so well you know he had a vision he said you know what we want to keep this going let's keep building and sustaining these native tokens and he said let's start a project that's going to be supporting droplet and he came up with this concept and you know he loves the gamification parts and tokenomics and mechanics so he had a big part of how this project is running um i'm kind of an advisor and social media manager like i like giving my input i like you know uh sharing some information that i've learned over the last three years so i've helped in that part we have Pooh Bear 123 who are the designers of the project and they coded the project for us. And we have CryptoCraft who are the beautiful NFT art specialists. They they killed it. Like if you guys seen the, the collection of cars that we have coming up, guys, they look immaculate. And, and they've been so patient. You know what I mean? Like we're a team here, but they've been so patient because we went back and forth for weeks trying to design these NFTs. But now they are top-notch NFTs. Like, it'll be a pleasure for me to have those in my wallet, honestly. And we have the beautiful support of the whole community in addition to Crypto Tiger, Legacy 7 Crypto, Lady Mania, Crypto Mark 7, S Crypto 101, and all of the rest of the community that is sharing and tweeting and, you know, giving us some ideas. A lot of you guys are making this whole thing happen. A few years ago, there's no way I would have thought I would participate in three different NFT projects. But look how times have changed, guys. And it's because of influencers like these guys, content creators, content creators like these guys, community members like you guys that were able to be in the position that we're in right now. So I'm super thankful. You know, it's Easter. Happy Easter to everybody. But I'm also thankful for being in this position. And I'm also thankful to have you guys part of this project. Now, the best part of this, uh, this whole 
video is the whitelist, right? So this is what I want you guys to do. I want you guys to leave a comment in the description below with hashtag I want a whitelist and I want you guys to tell me exactly why you want a whitelist, right? So that's going to be one winner. Tell me why you want the whitelist bot. What are you bullish on the project for? Tell me if you're bullish on the project. Tell me if you like the art. Tell me if you want to give the whitelist to somebody else. Tell me why you want the project whitelist, basically. So the next person that's going to be winning a whitelist is somebody who's going to be tagging Golden Lit Estates who's going to be tagging my Twitter. So you guys have been on my Twitter a million times. It's MoCrypto777. There's another fake one called 7777. That's not me. I'm three sevens. Tag me, tag Golden Lit Estates, and also hashtag I want a whitelist pot. That's the second winner. And I want somebody who's going to be guessing a number between 1 and 50 in the comment section below. 1 and 50 and I'm going to be running a random number generator and I'm going to be picking a winner from there. Guys, basically everything is going to be done on Wednesday. Oh, Cryptala, I didn't follow you. Everything is going to be done on Wednesday, guys. So make sure to leave your comment. Make sure to leave your number. Make sure to tag Golden Lit Estates and tag me on Twitter. And guys, let's get you guys some whitelist spots. All right, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I hope you guys are going to be participating in the draws for the whitelist spots. So I'm going to be drawing all these whitelist spots by Wednesday. So guys, tune into Wednesday's video where I'm going to be sharing the winners. So make sure to watch Wednesday's videos because your name is probably going to be shouted out on that video. All right, guys. So uh, thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you guys in the next one.